हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल आई विल बी शोइंग यू दैट हाउ टू कन्वर्ट द एच टी एम एल डॉक्यूमेंट टू पी डी एफ डॉक्यूमेंट यूजिंग अ लाइब्रेरी कॉल्ड एज एच टी एम एल टू पी डी एफ सो द ऑल डिटेल्ड ब्लॉग पोस्ट आई हैव रिटर्न ऑन माई कोडिंग शिक्षा वेबसाइट एंड आई हैव गिवन द लिंक इन द वीडियो डिस्क्रिप्शन यू कैन गो टू दिस ब्लॉग एंड फॉलो अलॉन्ग विद द वीडियो ऑल द सोर्स कोड इज गिवन हेयर हाउ टू गो अबाउट द थिंग स्टेप बाई स्टेप इंस्ट्रक्शन इज देयर सो इफ यू सर्च गो सर्च ऑन गूगल हेयर just search for this library which is html to pdf so we will be looking at a complete example on how to convert a html to pdf so here you just need to search for html to pdf cdn and you can go to this website in order to include this library which is content delivery network or you can go to my blog post directly here so if you go to it the very first step you need to do is that you need to copy the script tag simply copy it and here you need to make a index.html file here so we will be using some bootstrap as well here for just styling purposes so we have included the bootstrap cdn and also jquery cdn and right after this jquery uh, cdn so include the script tag here so basically this is html to pdf uh, library bundle.main.js so we have included this library so inside the body tag whatever we write here so we can write a div and we can give it a id that is let's suppose element and inside this we will have a lot of tags here let's suppose this is the first tag something is there first content and then we will have the second div tag this will be second content so let's suppose we need to add a page break as well page break is that uh, thing that you need to split out the content so this will be printed out on the first page of the pdf document the first div tag so here we need to add a page break so we can do this by adding a special class which comes in html to pdf so if you go to my second blog post i have also given written a complete blog post so i will give all the two blog post links here so this is the second blog post i have written here on the detailed subject that how to add a page break inside pdf document in html to pdf so here you will see here this is a special class that you can add here which is this div tag so just add this in between the stuff you need to split here so let's suppose in between these two div tags we will write this class here so this is a special class that we have given which is html to pdf page break so this is a class here this will split up the pdf for you and now you simply need to make the pdf here so here you can just write your custom javascript so first of all you will get the element so we can get it by document dot get element by id so here we need to get this element here which we have provided so we can get element by id so we can pass the id here element so this will get the element for us now we simply need to call html to pdf and we need to pass this element that's it and once you run this open with live server so you will see if you run this automatically this file one dot pdf will save here you can see this is first content it is printed on the first page so my pdf document contains two pages here on the first page it is containing the first content and now the second content is there you can see on the second page so in this way you can just uh, split out contents in various pages using html to pdf so here you can add images also instead of text here let's suppose after this we will have to add a image so image source so i have a image here inside my profile or jpeg i can add this image as well so so if i add this image so you will see now if i open this pdf you will see this image being embedded here this is the content here after this the image is there now inside the second page we have the second content
you can even add tables as well so let's suppose we want to add a table bootstrap table so we can add a table as well so you can just search for bootstrap tables so go to this website w3schools.com and they will provide you a simple table as well so so you can just add this basic html code for generating a table so just paste it here and now you will see so you can see this is a table here a new pdf file is generated and now you can see on the second page this table will be printed out you can see this is a table so in this way you can add as many stuff on your pdf document using html to pdf library so now i will tell you the some more options that you can pass here let's suppose put a comma and a set of curly brackets so here you can provide some options here so if you go to my blog post you will see at the bottom i have given these options here so simply you can copy this and i will paste it so here the first option is margin you can play with the margin here i have given 10 value and then the file name so you can provide a custom file name so here we have provided my file.pdf then you can provide image type jpeg you can check uh, just check the quality of the image that is embedded inside PDF then these additional options you can provide HTML to canvas and JS PDF so if you just save with these options here again if you refresh now you can see your file is downloaded I can just change this file to let's suppose sample.pdf And now you can see sample is generated so if i open this you will see some margin has been added here automatically because of this option that we have provided 10 here and you can see here so now this looks pretty good because of this additional options that we provided here so all the source code regarding this video will be there inside the video description so just go to the blog post and download all the source code and before you go I have made a website which is freemediatools.com this is my own tool based website where I add tools on a daily basis so please check out this website and share this website with your friends and also join the Facebook group and I will be seeing you in the next video.